This is a reminder that self-care doesn't really mean removing your body hair. Be like, oh, I love natural hair. Da -da -da. I'm just like, no, you love a type of natural, natural hair. hair. Let's Don't be lie. real. Society accepts. Yeah. I think the men have made a standard of beauty. Like, yeah, we course. just want to see it. Like, absolutely. if boys were okay. loving the afro, the short hair, do you yeah. not think yeah. everyone would do yeah. it? I, yeah, absolutely. This is a reminder that self-care doesn't really mean removing your body hair, but taking care of it with some oil, some lotion, some cream, and deeply falling in love with it and realizing how soft it can be and how much you could truly love and embrace it. It's beautiful. Guys will be like, oh, I love natural hair. Da -da -da. I'm just like, no, you love a type of natural, natural hair. hair. Let's Don't be lie. Real. There was this girl that made a TikTok and yeah. she was basically saying, at the end of the day, it's your money, it's your preference. You mm -hmm. can spend it on what you want, how you want to look. But has the standard become a bit too unrealistic? So standard being lashes, weave, mm -hmm. all this and that. It's for me, because mm -hmm. I'm some. I love that. I can't yeah, lie. I've I always do. been like this. Yeah. Like, everyone that knows me, I've been that girl yeah. that's just into just stuff like, like that. That, that girl. <laughs> <laughs> I've just been into stuff like that. But I also know how being into stuff as that has actually um, played mm -hmm. on my self-confidence mm -hmm. and also played on my own insecurities and, and also that there's this standard that I know that does well. Yeah. Let's be real. Like, yeah. if you look a certain way, your yeah. hair's on a certain way, yep. you have that look, yeah. you attract what the mainstream society accepts. She, yeah. I think the men have made a standard of beauty. Like, yeah, of we course. just want to see it. Like, absolutely. if boys were absolutely. loving the afro, the short hair, do you yeah. not think everyone yeah. would do yeah. it? I, yeah, absolutely. But the reality is, guys and guys will be like, oh, I love natural hair. Da -da -da. I'm just like, no, you love a type of natural, natural hair. hair. Don't be like, real. You don't like the 4C. No. You like the 3 Exotica. Let's you like real. that. Yeah. That's what you like. You like that. Don't, don't. Yeah. I feel like there's just so much politics like to even unpack it. Like, yeah. there's, like where would we even start and Stop. begin? Well, once again, these are some ladies in the UK here speaking about this, and I'm pretty sure men in the UK feel the same way. It doesn't matter whether your hair is 4C or not. We just want our women looking presentable with their hair. Like the last young lady, even though she was like super hairy, <laughs> dudes would rock with that as far as her hair. They would rock with that. There's tons of beautiful natural women out here, but a lot of you are just too lazy. Like both of these women right here, it looks disturbing when you see like that fake scalp right there. It looks completely disturbing when you rock that. But you ladies do it for other women. And then you try to use the makeup to cover it. But you can see where it's like not like sticking to the scalp and it's like ripples in it. Those hair hats, that stuff looks crazy, bro. Crazy. And any man, unless he's just scared to tell you, he would just prefer you to be natural. Now you're probably gonna get into, well, JR, they like Dominicans. They like the Dominicans because they're natural. Women back in the 90s, dudes wasn't flocking to these other women like that back in the 90s, when a lot of you were natural back in the 80s, you know what I'm saying? But when you start putting this stuff on, that's a lot to deal with. And just the smell of it, it's just too much going on. I would rather be with a woman that I know what she looks like when I wake up next to her instead of her hiding behind a face full of makeup and having to throw a hat on her head all the time, working out with these hair hats on. It's crazy. But we got another clip here where a lady talks about her experience with a guy she was dating. Let's get into it. I think this is Van Lathan, if I'm not mistaken, formerly of TMZ. Let's get into it. I'm texting this guy. We're texting back and forth. And we went... We went on one day. So the first time he met me, my hair was in a ponytail. The second time, I had a wig on, this wig. So they were texting, and I send a picture of myself this weekend. And I, as you can see, I'm still wearing a wig. He's like, you look so great, right? You look stunning. The very next text message, and I would like to read it, is P.S., I want your natural hair flow from the last time I saw you, the next time I see you. Yeah. With a kissy face. Yeah. I was seething. Okay. And he's black. For anybody who's wondering, he is a black man. This is a compliment that is of a bygone era. He's operating on a neo-soul playbook in the current day. Late 90s, early 2000s, into the 2000s, where it was like, Girl, let your natural show, let your natural flow. You don't have to do all of this. 
You don't have to wear no makeup. You don't have to do all of this stuff. I want you in your natural essence. You are the black woman. He even said natural flow. He's letting you know, I like you when you are at the core of racialosity. Here's the problem. We've moved past the point of you being able to dictate to a woman how she shows herself to you. He's operating on the old operating system. Good buddy, Van Lathan, I think that's his name. He's absolutely right. You cannot tell a woman, only certain women now, because there was a video that I, I watched where a woman said, I like wigs, but my man doesn't. So I don't wear wigs. So if men truly set the beauty standard, you ladies would listen, but you don't. You do it for other women. Women are very impressionable. Women like to follow other women. Now, I'm not saying there aren't natural women, and I love natural women. Like I said, I don't care if you got 4C hair or not, but a lot of you just like following suit, just want to have these different looks, as you say, and you want to throw something on. Jira, why is this always the subject of a woman's hair is a subject of such and such? Well, I guess it's a subject if you're buying someone else's hair to throw on your head. And if a man wants to make you his wife and he wants to take you seriously, nah. His opinion, you ladies got all the opinions all day on men. Why can't a man express his opinion if he wants you in your natural state? Without a face full of mud, without these different wigs, constantly getting your hair done with this stuff. Can't talk to anybody unless you throw this on your head. That's what I want to see from you. That is what's important. Now you can say, I think it's easy to just say men don't like it. Well, what if you're not dating? What if you're, as a lot of you ladies, the standard celibacy time, a lot of you've been celibate for the past two years, as you like to say. So who are you doing it for? You're doing it because it's easy, it's trendy, and you just don't feel like dealing with your hair at the end of the day. It's easy to just throw a hat on, just like with a lot of people. If you don't feel like messing with your hair, brushing your hair, or doing whatever with your hair, it's easy just to throw a hat on and go. It's easy to throw a bonnet on. It's easy to throw a scarf on and go. We just gotta be honest about these things. And you know men are saying this. You ask, there's several videos where people are asking men and men like natural, 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 natural. Like I said, just the concept of itself of just putting on somebody else's hair on your head is just crazy. And just not only doing that, all the pictures, you're, you're doing this and doing this with this thing. <laughs> I love a beautiful black woman in her essence, the way she's supposed to look instead of trying to look like something that she's not. Like if a woman said that she liked certain things in a dude, or if she liked a dude that bleaches his skin, she likes a dude who has a bald head, I'm not about to shave my head bald. I'm pretty sure a lot of dudes wouldn't, but that's just me, man. Let me know what you guys think though. Comment below. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Much blessings and abundance. Stick around for the next videos. It's gonna pop up on the screen below. That's where I'm gonna see you guys at. It's your favorite everything. This is wisdom. I'm the best. Let's run it up to a million. Quit playing with me. Peace.